Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to more Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2. We got super, super voided out trunks on the screen and we are going to fight Cell because last time perfect for, our Cell Perfect 4 pretty much destroyed Vegeta. So, yeah, we gotta do this now. You're dead, Cell! You really think so, Trunks? Um, you're really, he's really tall, Trunks. Still, Cell Perfect Form is going to find a problem here because Super Trunks is way stronger than Super Vegeta. But I'm going to find a problem here because Super, Vegeta, or Super Trunks is like one of the lowest characters on the tier list. He is awful. He is awful to play as. He feels awful. And he fights so slow. It, it's disgusting. He charges so slow. It's just so disgusting to play as him. And his burning attack costs four bars of energy. So that's just dumb. But whenever he breaks your guard, I mean, he breaks your freaking guard, so that's kind of nice. You see how long it took to charge up that punch? It's like, yes, I'm hurting him, but my god, at what cost? Super slow punching! Ugh. Super slow punch! Finish Buster! He blocked it. At least I'm kind of a tank, so I can I can do this all day. Oh god, all my moves cost four bars of energy, are you kidding me? At least I have Explosive Wave, that's good. That's something to fall back on when I start losing these fights. Ugh, super slow fighting combos! Oh crap, countered me. There we go. There we go. I need to do my burning attack. My finish buster is too risky. I can't I can't risk those four bars of energy on finish buster. I am strong enough to defeat Cell in this form though, so I should be able to do it. Inexperience power up. Ah. Oh. oh crap, my attacks are too slow. Ow. I want to do my experience inexperience power up. Come on. Ugh. Inexperience power up because I'm an inexperienced warrior. Oh god, my my speed stat even went down even more. But all my other stats went up, so it might be worth it. Super explosive wave! Alright, we did it, people. Super Trunks defeated the almighty Purcell Perfect Form. One of my favorite characters, my fourth best character in... What would that be called? What was that? In BT3. Hopefully we can beat him. Or hopefully that defeated him, I mean. Because, honestly, I don't know if I can fight him anymore. He's, uh... He hasn't done any of his super, so you haven't seen him for real. He was unable to defeat Cell. You fool. Ooh, 10 days. In 10 days, the Cell games are going to happen. And Hercule, the champion of the world, vows to stop Cell's evil ways. For those of you that don't know who Hercule is, he is a god-tier character in BT3, and I hate anybody that uses him. Super annoying to fight Hercule. And he is, he is very, very, he, he deserves to be in the Cell games. And it looks like we're going to be playing as the champ right now. Let's do it. This is my favorite arena. In BT3, this is the only arena me and my friends use when we, when we fight competitively. It's the only one with that, that's like a real stage. There's no real hazards. There's no water. Nothing stupid. Oh crap, the tournament has started. And Hercule decides he wants right, the first match. Okay, so Hercule, this might be a super hard fight for me. It, this is an escape battle. I just have to survive the fight. The time limit. And I don't know if the Cell Games has a ring out rule. I know in the show they kind of did and it kind of didn't. So I'm, I'm going to see what happens. Hercule only has one bar of health. So this could go really bad. Oh, his, oh they switched around his moves. Present Bomb is on the wrong thing now. All right, let me just charge up. I can survive for 60 seconds if he's not looking at me. Oh yeah, Hercule is just a regular human, so any normal attacks he does has no flinch. All of Hercule's normal attacks do not flinch his opponent. Let's dodge that super ball of energy. Holy crap. King of Dreamers. 
Yeah, I love the little head wiggle there. <laughs> and then he just throws him. He just freaking throws him. And as you can see, since he's wearing a jetpack, I cannot actually fly. So if I'm if I'm off the ground even a little, I can't charge up. I can spam with this character. Oh god, don't hit me. <laughs> oh, that's kind of how Hercule loses in the show, but whatever. We're still in the game. We're still in the game, people. We're still in the game. Yeah, Hercule's god tier. He's a spammer in the other game. He's a very, very good spammer. And he's a good user of False Courage, which gives him super armor. Which is good, because anybody that fights Hercule basically has super armor because Hercule can't hit you. But you don't hit with Hercule, you just do this. Oh crap, I ran out of False Courage. Too easy, dynamic mess him up punch. Da -da -da -da, zero damage. Zero, zero. Zero. Oh, nope, that wasn't zero. Hey, that one actually did some real damage. Hooray. We did it. We won. Hercule won by not dying. They call him Hercule in this game, but his real name is actually Mr. Satan. It's a pretty good name. Hey, we got the silver members card. That's pretty cool. I was currently I was currently a bronze member, so being upgraded to silver is pretty nice. Let's see where we're going now. Now, I'm going to 100% guess that Hercule lost in the cutscene, so... Let's see. Yeah. It is time for the Cell Games to begin. Who will go first? Yeah, well, let's send in Trunks first since he's like the weakest one there. Or Piccolo. Not nah, Trunks. Not nah, Piccolo. Piccolo's the weakest. Oh, Goku train. Okay. Goku also trained in that chamber and has a year's worth of training under his belt. So now he is going to fight Cell. Hopefully he is strong enough to beat Cell, but who knows. It's Goku. Whenever Goku fights, that usually means the game is over. So everyone else showing up to the Cell games was basically worthless. Ooh, are we getting a cutscene? Nice. Controller is down. Oh, wait. No, never mind. Will it be you, Goku? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I was hoping to save the best for last. Sorry, Cell. Goku wants to fight now. So, Goku Super Saiyan versus Cell. After all that training, Goku does not go Super. He goes Super Saiyan. He never even needs Super. Goku Super Saiyan is stronger than Super Vegeta. So, the 1.5 boost doesn't even matter. There we go. Let's start this battle off with a few big hits. Remember, in the Cell games, there was supposed to be a ring out rule, but Cell kind of turns it off in this fight, so there's no ring out rule. We can just do whatever we want. Which is also why we do this as a tournament legal stage, and the only stage we actually play on. Because not only is it a, bi a big old stage that's really good, um, but it's just a cool environment, too. There's not too many places to hide. It's just a big old map to fight on. Like, you can run away here, but you can't really hide here, which is good. Instant Kamehameha! And this is where Goku properly got the instant Kamehameha, but I've been using it before this point. And he doesn't use it like this, he uses it way cooler in the show. So I recommend you see that scene. Angry Kamehameha! Which almost did as much as instant. Alright, let's do this. Come on, Cell. Goku's pissed. He wants a real fight. Ooh, throw a mountain, that's extra damage. Alright, let's finish you the way you're supposed to be finished, with instant Kamehameha. Goodbye, Cell. Goku loved you. I want you to know that. And dead. Man, that was an easy fight. Cell perfect form is nothing compared to Goku. Look at that. Beauty, beauty, beauty. We were able to defeat the cell, perfect cell. We are in the cell games and it's already over. And you know, we know we won because whenever Goku wins, that basically means the story is over. So I hope you guys enjoyed the cell games. Pretty good. Pretty good, honestly. And what the hell's going on here? Okay, this is a real cutscene, so I'm putting my controller down. Hey, Gohan's a teen now. He's not a little kid. Oh, wait. 
Now that I know how strong you really are, I think I'd better quit while I'm ahead. Goku has quit the match. Gohan, it's your turn. And Gohan is going to fight Cell. So apparently Goku isn't strong enough to beat Cell. And the only one in Goku's mind that is, is Gohan. Which is really weird, because Gohan really hasn't had any fights where he, you know, won. He's had fights where he's done work, but he's never actually won a fight before. So this is going to be, this is going to be a first time if he can do it. Plus, he's only a Super Saiyan, so this isn't really that strong. You are one cocky little brat. Are you ready? He, he didn't say anything. Like, if, if Gohan said, I'm going to freaking screw you up, then maybe you could say that. But Gohan didn't say anything. So why are you calling him a cocky brat? Come on, Yamcha. Did you guys notice that Yamcha, Tien, and all them weren't even there? They didn't want to put their models there, even though they were there in the Cell games. Alright, so we haven't used this form of Teen Gohan before. Teen Gohan is really strong. I mean, this guy's God tier. This form of, of Gohan's God tier, and his next form is God tier. His base form might even be God tier. It might be high tier, but it's it's super strong. So you got to be careful. You don't want to just you don't want to just win the battle in one one blow. You want it to be interesting. Because after training with his dad for a full year, Gohan has become a really strong fighter. Oh, nice! You stopped me there, so. I'm actually a little upset about that. Yeah, I got him when he was getting up. So basically, this is just Delta Combination, but it's 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 Gohan. You know, Android 17 was using Delta Combination. There you go. All right, so I have Masenko and I have Delta Combination. So what's my ultimate? I mean, I pretty I'm pretty sure I know what it is. It's Super Combat. Yeah, it's Super Combat. Yeah. That's usually everyone's go-to ultimate. And it did a ton of damage. Ooh, you got a good kick on me. Oh, he didn't hit the wall. Damn it. He just fell against the wall. Oh my god, how did you... You just ran under me? No, I'll just kill you with fighting. I don't need to kill you with anything else. Wait, does this uh, oh, does this Gohan have explosive wave? Because that would that would make him pretty broken. Gohan usually does have explosive wave though. He's a broken character. Damn it! Oh crap! I notice Cell has the energy all around him because he's maxed out on his power. And we win. Goodbye, Cell. Oh, Goku was right to send in Gohan. By the way, Team Gohan is the best Gohan by far. It looks the coolest. There's only one Gohan that comes even close, and we're not gonna see him for a while, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say it just yet. But this is probably the best Gohan, with a, only one other Gohan being close to like. If you said the other one was your favorite, I could understand why. Oh, we lost. But the, Goku picked you. Goku said you were gonna win. God damn it. Gohan was too kind and he didn't go serious against Cell, so now everyone's gonna die. God damn it, Goku, you raised a quitter. You raised a quitter. And now everyone else has to fight. Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks. Because freaking Gohan didn't want to go all out. But who are they gonna fight? Because if they all fight Cell, then they're just gonna win, probably. Oh. That's who they're gonna fight. Zell reproduce some Cell Juniors. That's a creepy thing. Watch out! Those guys are stronger than you think. All right, so everybody's damaged, and everyone's gonna be fighting five Cell Juniors, and we can only pick three characters. I'm pretty much just gonna pick our Super Saiyans. That's it. And they're all like level 200. They're all gonna kick our asses, and this is an escape battle. So these Cell Juniors are so strong that our Z, our Z fighters aren't strong enough to fight them. And Cell thought he was he was going to get this big fight from Goku, but Cell Junior's strong enough to fight him. So that's kind of sad. But it's a full two-minute battle. So we got to survive for a very long time. 
Oh crap, you guys are freaking strong. Holy crap. On tier list wise though, I don't think Cell Juniors are very high. I think they're actually kind of weak. Like, I'm pretty sure they're usable, I just don't think they're that good. So, I don't know. If that's, if they're, if that's what your thing is to play these guys, then go ahead. I don't recommend it though. There's definitely better characters out there. Hey, Special Bean Cannon's pretty cool though. Alright, let's move your smash you. There we go. You're doing good, Goku. Just need to get some max power. And don't let him get to max power. Instant come my way up. This is what I used to kill your daddy. But he didn't die to it, so I'm hoping you do. Alright, and that buys me enough time to charge. Holy crap. That move's way too good. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. You can't block special beam cannon, I forgot. I think you can in BT3, but not in this one. And this is going to be the killing blow. Nice. Okay, we killed him in 60 seconds, so that means I can only kill four of these, and there's five of them. Damn. I won't be able to do it. Unless I just get really good against this one all of a sudden. Or the exact opposite could happen. Yeah, that's a thing. Crap. At least fast spiders. I'll give them that. Damn it. They're kicking my ass. Holy crap. Oh, crap. I lost Goku. There's still 95, 94 seconds left and I lost Goku. That is not good. Super Edge, you love Bali. And he dodged all of it. Oh my god, Vegeta's moves aren't even injuring this guy. Oh, Dragon Ball! Oh crap, I'm gonna die if I try to get that Dragon Ball. But I want it. I want the Dragon Ball. Get out of my way! Okay, just grab it. Just grab it. Got it. Haha! -ha! You tried to stop me, but you couldn't. Explosive wave! Alright, got good damage on him. You fool. Oh crap, base form Vegeta really isn't strong enough for this. Oh crap. His combos aren't ending. There we go. Okay. Bought me some time. I'm going Super Saiyan. This isn't this isn't buff Vegeta, this is just Super Saiyan Vegeta. Wait, I can go buff? Okay, we're going buff Vegeta. Hell yeah. Super Vegeta to the rescue. This form of Vegeta can do it. Still not as strong as Goku, but definitely can do work. Big bang attack! Yeah, there we go. Ooh, nice. Nice one, Cell Jr. Nice. And you're still dead, but good fight, good fight. Bring in the next one. Alright, I don't think we have any chance of losing, so I'm just going to go all out. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Come on, Cell, you're stronger than this. Come on, bring it on. I'm all, I'm going all out now, no more uh, screwing around. Oh, crap. Ah, you're wasting your own time. Big Bang Attack! Ha <laughs> ha! Hit you in the time up. Alright, that counts as a win, everybody. We did it. I don't know why that counts as a win, but it does. And we got the four-star Dragon Ball, which is awesome. Four-star Dragon Ball is going to come in handy. Hell, if we get three more, I might actually summon Shenron on the freaking channel. And I'll be like, hey guys, this is what you can do with Shenron. But who knows? That might never happen. Just depends on if there's enough arcs. And it turns out the Cell Juniors are stronger than every single Z fighter there. And Gohan was not angry. <laughs> Even after all that, Gohan still isn't mad. Everyone is dying on the floor. No one. Well, I'm not pissed. I'm just cool. Ah, poor Gohan. Oh, nope. He's mad. I know you probably can't notice it, but this is the coolest form of Gohan right here. Teen Gohan Super Saiyan 2. You, you've changed. 
You're not gonna get away with this any longer. Oh yeah, give me them cells. Look at that. Compared to him, the cells were almost level 200 compared to everybody else. Compared to Super Saiyan 2 Teen Gohan, they are nothing. They are worth nothing. This is a god tier character I'm picking right now. This is a god tier character one of my friends uses. The guy who's ranked number one and was champion at one point. This guy is so good. His fighting style feels super good. Obviously, I'm talking about BT3, so you might not be able to see it in here. His moves are super good. Oh, okay, in this game, they're not super good. Never mind. Just remember, whenever I talk, I'm talking about BT3. I'm not talking about this game. This game is just whatever. Get up. His fighting style looks really cool, though. It's so quick. Bam. Look at that. Because in the other game, he doesn't have Masenko. He just has a Super Kamehameha that comes out instantly, and it's super powerful. And it's bigger than normal Kamehameha's. It's so cool. And it's amazing, and it's broken, and I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. I hate when I have to fight my friend and he uses it because he's super good, but... I mean... Now that I get to use some... Well, I don't get to use it in this game, but now that I get to feel the power of the combos and everything... Ugh... Oh. The only drawback for Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan is he has a 10% defense loss. So he takes 10% extra damage to all attacks. Father, son, Kamehameha! Alright, this move's badass in this game. It's like the most badass move ever. Wait, why is it two hands? Okay, it's more badass in BT3, actually. Never mind, more badass in BT3. Still cool move. But BT3, it's definitely better. Which is rare. Usually the supers are better in this game. But it turns out that's one of the only supers that isn't. Alright, get back up. And that didn't do shit. Oh my god, this move does so much damage. Point blank move! Now I'm max power! Damn it, I didn't get the attack again. I'm never gonna stop attacking you! And I lost my max power. Shit. Well, whatever. I got the kill. Oh crap, he swept me. Oh crap. Knocked me through the stage at least. That's pretty good. But now I'm going to have to start kicking your ass. You did your best, okay, Cell Jr.? I want you to remember that. There's only two of you left and you're not going to make it. Jesus Christ, I just beat him to death. I didn't even need to do any moves. I just beat him to death. Holy crap, Gohan Strong. Oh my god, that was 10,000 damage. It feels so good to be a god. Alright, I got my normal charge speed back. Aw, oh, you jerk, you stopped me right before max power. I was gonna do a max power combo. Now I'm gonna do it. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can block all you want. It won't make a difference. Ma say go. And he dodged it. That jerk. He dodged it when he wasn't even locked on. That's some stupid shit right there. And he's dead. Good fight. Good fight, Cells. That that honestly didn't even feel long. Like that took no time at all. It felt so good to do that. Cell Jr. is now a character. We got him. A registered character at that. Not bad. Not bad, everybody. We're kicking ass today. Now that we're freaking seeing Gohan Super Saiyan 2, I feel unbeatable. Oh, Cell is actually kind of scared. Nice. This guy who's been confident the entire time is now starting to shake in his boots. I like it. I like when they show fear. They should show fear. Alright, let's go back to the Cell Games Arena and let's get some more kills. Oh, I guess there's only one person to kill left. Cell himself. Don't get fuming. That tiny brain of yours lets you Actually, he's a genius. I don't think I can. I know I can. Oh crap, Cell, you're dead. Hmm, impressive. Now it's my turn. 
witness the awesome power of perfection. Yeah, you're not gonna win, Cell. I'm sorry. You're not even level 100. That's how weak you are compared to this Gohan. You're you're gonna die. You're gonna die, and it's gonna be sad for nobody. It's gonna be amazing, beautiful, actually. Beautiful, even I should say. I might even just try to combo you to death because Gohan's combos are amazing. Oh my god, I feel so strong and fast. I can do it all. I feel so strong. Look at this. It never ends. It's just free kills. Nope, you're not getting any combos on me. I'm too strong now. I'm doing the same combo, but it does so much damage. That's why I spam it. Oh, finally I missed, but I have explosive wave, so it doesn't matter if I miss. Oh, missed again. Doesn't matter. Ooh, you actually got some damage on me. Good for you, Cell. Good for you. You loser. Now you're dead. Oh, nope. Now you're dead. Goodbye. You lived? Yeah. <laughs> Just throw a little key blast and he's dead. Uh, we got Cell Perfect form. Now I can play as one of my best characters. Obviously not in this game. I'm still talking BT3, but my god. Oh, that felt good. It felt good to beat myself up. I like it. Oh, and he hit him so hard that Android 18 got spat out. Uh-oh. Cell was about to self-destruct and take the Earth with it, but luckily Goku teleported him away. This is all Gohan's fault because he could have just killed Cell, but instead he didn't. Oh, freaking Gohan. Why didn't you just kill Cell when you had the chance? Now Goku's dead. King Kai's dead because Goku teleported to King Kai's planet. But at least Cell's dead, so it was all... I mean, it still teaches you not to hold back, but at least it, it, it wasn't the worst at case. Oh, wait, what happened? An ominous wind engulfed the Z Fighters, and in a sudden flash, Trunks was struck down. Uh, Trunks is dead. <laughs> Who was it that I hit? Was it Trunks? And now, Cell's back. Cell has survived. Having absorbed Goku's abilities, the monster has returned. Even more powerful than before. This is perfect Cell. Not Cell perfect form, perfect Cell. And in Budokai Tenkaichi 3, he's known as the combo master. He is a really good fighter. I don't use him very often, but sometimes I transform into him. because of my arrogance. And now... I'm glad that I can finally avenge him. Oh boy. <laughs> There'll have to be bigger hands than that. I doubt things are going to turn out the way you hope they will. So this cell is way stronger because he has the same the biology as the Saiyans. So last. since he almost died and came back at full health, he is now super strong. It's going to take everybody to take down this cell. Everybody. But in actuality, I'm probably just going to kick his ass. So I probably won't need everybody. We'll see. This is cell, a perfect cell, though, so I should be more serious. Come on, cell. Bring it on. I'll take you down with Gohan Super Saiyan 2. Oh my god, you have almost maxed out health bars. This is scary. Okay, this is going to be a freaking scary battle. Oh, he has death beam, by the way. Crap. That did 25,000 day. <coughs> that did two bars of health and a half? Two and a half bars of health for that one move. That one counter did half a bar of health. Okay, okay, I see, I see how this is gonna end now. Never mind. Time for me to start spamming. Never mind. I was gonna fight you like a real man, but it turns out you're strong as freaking hell. Alright, let's just dodge that one. I have zero health with Gohan. Luckily, I can spam from here. And if he wants to use Death Beam, that's fine. He can keep using Death Beam for all I care. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I thought the max power would knock him back, but it did not. Uh, can everybody else just spam him to death? Because if they don't, we're dead. Super Angie, wait, volley! And he dodged it. Oh my god. I saw, a, I saw a freaking Dragon Ball. But I can't even get to it because I can't win this fight if I don't take it seriously. And I had to be Vegeta not even transformed so I don't even have my dash attack. Alright, let's do this so I have amazing impact at least. Amazing impact! I want that Dragon Ball. Even if it costs me this whole match. I got it! Oh crap, it cost me the match. This Scrabble's gonna do like 8,000. It did do like 8,000. 
Oh crap, he countered me for 4,000. Holy crap. I'm running. At least I can beat him in Super Saiyan form. I don't even think I need the other form. Because if I go Super Vegeta, yes, I get a little bit stronger, a little bit stronger defenses, but against this cell, it won't matter. I mostly just need to spam. Okay, got him to block. Now that he's blocking, I can get him. Alright, maybe I should go Super, because this is this is kind of stressful. Nope, never mind. Explosive wave. Amazing impact! Get the kill! We did it! And Vegeta did it! He beat he beat Cell like he did in the like he did in the show. Which actually it is kind of the whole reason that we beat Cell in the show is because of Vegeta, so he kind of deserves it. Hey, and we got the five-star Dragon Ball. We only need two more Dragon Balls, everybody. Holy crap. Freaking Android Saga. One of the best sagas in the game. That was fun as hell. Pretty sure that was it. Oh. Nope, it looks like we lost. Gohan's one arm down. And Cell's still full power. No time to play. I'll have to end this soon. Cell's powered up even more than we expected. Come on, Gohan. Unleash your rage. Oh crap. Prepare for your demise. I'm going to destroy this whole pathetic planet. He's doing the solar Kamehameha. Please, Gohan, you have so much power. Don't be a quitter. Hey! Don't give up, Gohan! Dad, where are you? Go on! Hit him with the best Kamehameha you've got! You can win. I know you can. Do it, Gohan. Do it for the fans. Come on. We can do this together. Right. He's doing it. One handed. Like his angry dad. Oh, God. That's super close range. It's his daddy. Oh my god, come on, Gohan. Hold on. Hold on, Gohan. You're not using your full power. You have to let it all out. That's loud. Farewell. Oh! Vegeta saves the day. Now. Hits him in the side of the head. That is one of the most epic scenes in Dragon Ball history right there. In PS2 format for y'all. <laughs> God, do I love that scene. The one-handed father-son Kamehameha versus Solar Kamehameha. And Vegeta gives him an opening to do it. Thanks to the efforts of Goku and his friends, the evil cell was finally destroyed. The battle now over. The Sea Fighters called upon Shinra to bring back all those who were killed by Cell. Goku, however, decided not to return. He left the Earth in Gohan's care while he continued his training in other worlds. In other words, hell. Thus, peace was restored, and the Z Fighters were able to return to their quiet lives. Gohan did it. He saved the world with his unbelievable power. And the Android Saga has come to a close. Like always, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. And before I let you guys go, I want you to see what we'll be doing next time. Because the Android Saga is not the final saga. There's still plenty of sub-sagas and a big saga coming up. The next saga we will be doing is Super Android 13. Yep, yet another Android. Thank you all for watching, and goodbye.